machine with the capacity up to 6 kilos for gold investment powder or 3 kilos platinum investment powder gold. The operation of is very simple. First of all, this machine is, has been previously connected to the water plant and to a vacuum pump. We have a vacuum pump in this case uh, located down the machine and already connected with the electrical part of the machine. But we can connect uh, a separate vacuum pump, plugging the vacuum pump in the rear part of the unit, connecting the vacuum hose here, and this one is the water connection pipe. The machine uh, works completely under vacuum and is a friendly using machine. The first operation that we have to do is to load the flask on the plate, then to position the flask plate caring that the hexagonal sprue for the moving of the plate uh, is matching properly. Fill quantity of investment uh, the mixing uh, container. Let's say that uh, we fix uh, four kilos investment powder now. Place uh, the mixing container matching uh, the correspondence reference uh, correctly. <laughs> Insert uh, the mixing blade, trying uh, to keep uh, the hole for the water cap uh, on the right positioning. Positioning. Insert again the top motor, helping uh, the correct insertion. Okay, and that's it. Previously, we have loaded uh, in the water dosing tank uh, with a graduate scale uh, that is already proportionate on the measure on the ratio of uh, 40 percent. Uh, I mean, for one for each kilo of uh, dry powder, we will load uh, 400 cc of water. The water here has been uh, uh, degasificated. So what we do now is uh, to start the vacuum pump by holding the top cap we are reaching the vacuum in the flask chamber and in the container where the dry powder has been placed once we have reached the top vacuum value we stop the vacuum pump and we are now ready for the mixing operation. Let's uh, say that we have loaded four kilos uh, dry powder here. So we will uh, get the water level down up to 40 to transfer the exact proportion of water. By opening uh, the tap, uh, the tap uh, here, you see that the water is transferred to the mixing container exactly in the proportion. I'm indicating four because uh, it is supposed that four kilos of dry powder has been loaded. I start the mixing the, during the mixing I can adjust the intensity of the mixing speed I can reverse the rotation of the mixing but basically I have a timer here that is counting down the preset time that previously I set. I set it in this case four minutes, 240 seconds. 
The setting of the timer is very simple. We have minus or plus here to select. During this timing, I can control my mixing. If I see, like in this case, that the mixing speed is too fast, I can reduce it. The best mixing comes when I got a V-funnel, V-shape here, like this one. Because the mixing speed depends from the quantity of investment powder that I've loaded. Now, during this operation, by rotating the plate, I can go directly in the corner. have almost reached the total mixing time 10 seconds left now and uh, what is going to happen that is a buzzer will sound and inform the operator that he is a pouring time okay the mixing sto uh, stops uh, the buzzer is uh, sound at this moment uh, I have to open by pulling uh, this knob uh, in order to pour the investment down into the flask. Once the flask has been filled, I will move to the next one. I will reopen the pouring tap until the second flask will be filled. Close again, move to the third one, and so on. Once uh, the flask has been totally filled, I will start uh, the vibration. The vibration here could be adjusted in intensity or let let have a smooth uh, vibration. Vibration here is only on vertical direction. A couple of minutes of vibration will be enough. At the end of the vibration, I will stop. I will open the vacuum releasing 